Guys, what's up? Good morning. It's Sunday morning. It's beautiful out. I'm, I'm at church right now doing my uh, security detail service. We're between services right now, so I'm going to take a stroll over to our community garden and just take a look at it. It's kind of kind of muddy over here, so i got to kind of be careful leading up to it. But uh, let me turn this camera around and... Uh, so yes, we did really, guys, uh, really successful uh, this past year on on the stuff that we grew to share with the community. So anyway, let me let me take a turn around here on this camera here and kind of show you what uh, is still left here in the garden, uh, especially with the collard greens. We had a tremendous, tremendous harvest all year long with the, the collard greens. Grew a lot of onions, a lot of tomatoes and cucumbers, a lot of a lot of pumpkins too. We did a lot of pumpkins and we did um, a lot of watermelons, and uh, they were great, nice tasting watermelons. But let me turn you to turn this around and kind of give you a glance of how things are looking here in the community garden right now. So I don't want to walk in there right now because it's, it's it's real muddy and uh, got my church shoes on. <laughs> so you know I can't get my uh, church shoes all muddy because uh, you know don't want the deacons looking at me like I'm crazy but uh, there's there's the compost bin that I uh, I put together I noticed I'm gonna have to talk to some of my, my folks over here because on one of them I noticed they're using it as a trash to dump uh you know plastic bags and all that and that's not what i built it for so i have to bring that up at our meeting over there we have a, a comp uh it's not a compost pile but it's a, it's a wood chips but they've been sitting there for about two or three years now so they are really aged real well and then back back over here we have a whole bunch of the you know the spent uh uh, pepper and tomato plants and then I'm gonna I told them I told the guys to pile it back there that I'm going to incorporate break it down and incorporate it into the compost piles so that it can further break down got our two wheelers over there and uh, we put this we put this shed here together so that we could store all our all our stuff in there so I, I I've been bringing down a lot a lot of uh, of the coffee grinds that I pick up at uh, at the Starbucks, and there's a lot of the a lot of our gardeners that work in the garden. They love using the um, coffee grinds. So you know I'm I'm trying to tell them to make sure that the coffee grinds that before the season starts again to incorporated into the soil so it has some time there to break down also i'm also adding a lot to our compost pile there so it can inoculate a little bit um before it actually you know just use it right into the garden but anyway this is uh, quick you can see all the mud in there and it's all wet right now we've had some some rains over the past couple days we did like a little rock, a little rock garden. We uh, all <laughs> had a whole bunch of rocks and we all painted them and just put, um, you know, any anything that you was thinking about or that you wanted to do. Like right here, you got some, you got some ladybugs. This one right here did a beautiful, with the flower on it. This one right here got like a little tree. Somebody right here drew a face. <laughs> I did a little frog. I did a little frog that grows only in uh, Puerto Rico, where I'm from, and um, it's called the coqui. And that's where I grew. I, well, I didn't grow up in Puerto Rico because I, I left Puerto Rico like 54 years ago when I was a young kid. I left there when I was five years old. So, but that's my. That's my home country, 
and uh, the coqui only grows in Puerto Rico. Um, it's only I'm sorry, it only found in Puerto Rico. So I I, I drew it, but I also took my little coqui home with me um, a few days ago because um, I'm gonna start another rock garden over there, and I want to put it into my rock garden. Hey, this, this Rasta man, he's headed to youth church. Hey, what's up, Rasta man? How you doing? Hey, man. All right, so, all right, man, so you headed to youth church? Yes, sir. All right. <laughs> all right, man, I, I, I'll see you when you get out of there. All right.